Welcome back to my channel guys. Today I'm going to be showing you how I make my iced coffee. So this is new to me. I typically used to make iced coffee with like instant coffee but I realized it didn't taste that nice once I started drinking good coffee. So I went ahead and I bought myself a French press which I have actually only used once so this could be a complete disaster. If you're seeing the footage that means it wasn't that means it came out good. So we're going to need a few things here. We're going to need some brewed coffee so I went ahead and I used my French press to make the coffee. I got this on Amazon. I'll link it below. Then we're gonna need some classic syrup, some sweetener, whatever you want to call it. I put equal parts sugar and equal parts hot water and I mix that and that created my simple syrup. Then you're gonna need a mason jar because you want this to look aesthetic as fuck because what's the point in drinking iced coffee if it's not in a mason jar? Then you're gonna need some milk. I like to use soy milk. You can use almond, you can use whatever the fuck you want. I like to use soy milk. This is the coffee I use. It's a Starbucks Blonde Roast Espresso Mix and it is, well it was coffee beans, it's ground into the French press grind so you can ask them to do whatever but um, yeah, you can use any coffee. This is the one that I prefer. So next you're going to want to take your mason jar and you're going to pour this coffee into the mason jar and they're going to, you know, I don't know what I was saying to be honest. I was supposed to make a joke there but I fucking didn't so that was just lame. Then you're going to take your milk and pour that in and watch it be a satisfying ribbon delight of milky goodness in your coffee. <laughs> Next, you're gonna go ahead and add your sweetener. So you're gonna put as much as you want or as little. I like to put a decent amount because I like my coffee a little bit sweeter. So I'll probably put half of that in. Now we're gonna mix it all together. So I forgot to mention something. In my syrup, I actually put like a drop or two of vanilla extract, sugar and water. And so there's a little bit of vanilla taste in here. And voila, let's try it. Okay, so now that we have made our little iced coffee, we're gonna try it. Oh my god, it's actually good! I'm super sick right now, so I can't taste it 100%, but it's actually so good, I'm so happy! I'm gonna save so much money! Oh my god, this french press is amazing! If you guys want like a tutorial on how I had this prepared for the morning after, let me know and I'll show you guys how to use a French press. It's super, super simple. I'm really happy because that was so good. And now I have actually the perfect amount to top up my cup once it's like halfway done or whatever. But this is so good. It tastes like, um, I don't know, but it tastes good. I used Starbucks blonde coffee beans to make this and I bought those for $18. They ask you if you want it ground, say yes if you're gonna be using one of these things. So that concludes my tutorial on how I make my iced coffee. If you guys enjoyed it, then make sure to subscribe. I also have an iced matcha latte video, and I'm also gonna learn how to make like a really good iced chai latte using tea bags, because I know nobody's gonna buy the Tazo chai syrup because it's fucking expensive. So I'm gonna learn how to do that. I'm gonna make a video on that. I'm just gonna keep like, you know, expanding my barista talents and teach you guys what I learned along the way. <laughs> So the goal is to not spend money on Starbucks eventually because I like to waste my money a lot. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe to me on YouTube and check me out on Instagram and wherever else your heart desires. Thank you guys for watching this video and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I think I already said that, but whatever. I'll see you next time. Bye. <laughs>